Repeatedly reading the same page on a block can have a negative impact over time on the physical quality of its neighbouring pages. This effect is called read disturb and it occurs when a page is read frequently. The reason for this is a shift in the voltage threshold of the neighbouring cells. Because the voltages of read operations are much lower than those used during programming, many read cycles are needed to cause a read disturb. Read disturbs are common in navigation systems and other systems where the same page of data is read repeatedly, for example, the data representing your home address. This piece of data is stored on a page somewhere on the NAND flash and every time it is read, voltage is sent through the string of pages within the block, influencing the neighbouring pages ever so slightly. Eventually this takes its toll and can cause a read disturb error, which means that the value originally stored on the neighbouring cells can no longer be retrieved. Luckily, read disturb is not permanent and the cells that were disturbed previously will erase and program normally afterwards. The NAND flash controller managing the flash monitors how often pages are read. Once a page reaches a certain threshold, the memory controller recognises that its neighbouring pages could soon be negatively impacted by the read voltages streaming through the strings. To avoid a read disturb, it rewrites the neighbouring pages elsewhere on the flash. I hope this video taught you something new. If you liked it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and